and Sergio draw eagle. An eagle. Yeah, we hope you're going to follow along. You need your drawing supplies. We're going to use crayons and paper. Paper. Yeah. <laughs> what does the word eagle start with? E. E. Yeah, the letter E. So first we're going to draw the letter E and then turn it into an eagle. You ready to start? Yes. <laughs> Let's first draw a line down, and we're gonna draw on the left side of our paper. This is for the first part of our letter E. So we start here and draw it down to there. Yes, then we're gonna draw three more lines going across this way. So one at the very top, and then we could do one at the very bottom, and then one right in the middle. There's our letter E. Good job, give me five. <laughs> You're going to give me five with the crayon <laughs> with this hand. Yes. <laughs> now let's turn it into an eagle. We're going to connect this side of our letter E all the way down. Whee! There you go. Now let's draw the beak. We're going to draw a big curve that comes out of the head. So the top part is the head and this is the body. There you go. And down. Oh, I love that you have the hook on it too. Now we're going to curve back into the head. <laughs> and then we're going to draw the bottom of the beak. Oh, you know what you could do? You could draw a curve that starts here and comes up into there. There you go. And let's also draw a little circle for the nostril. <laughs> and let's also draw a circle for the eye. Now let's draw, oh, I love that your eye is over there. Now let's draw the wing. Let's draw a curve that starts here on the shoulder and we're going to curve down to the corner. Bye. What do eagles usually sit on? Branches. Yeah, in a tree. We're going to draw the top of the branch. Let's draw one line that starts here and comes out to there. And then let's draw another one on this side for the other side of our branch. We'll start there and out to here. There you go. Now let's draw the bottom of the branch. I'm going to draw it like this, coming across to the other side. There you go. Let's also draw the feet or the talons. We're going to draw a U shape right here for one foot and another U shape for the other foot. Then let's draw the toes. We're going to draw a line right down the middle of each foot. One and two. What's our eagle missing down here? A tail. Yeah, the tail. Let's draw two lines coming out. But look, they kind of come out this way. They're diagonal. One, two. And then let's connect the bottom. And then let's add two more lines for feathers inside of the tail. What's our branch missing? Leaves. Yeah, leaves. Let's draw a curve that comes out and then back in. Oh, I love that you added on the bottom. I'm gonna draw one on the bottom too, right here. And you could add another one over here. You could add it to the top. Oh, I love that yours is different. They both turned out awesome. And it's okay that they're different because the most important thing is- To have fun and practice. And practice, remember to practice. Okay, what do we still need to do to our drawings? Color it. Yeah, color it. This part we're going to fast forward, so remember to pause the video and take time to color your drawings. When we're coloring, let's leave the head white so that it looks like a bald eagle. Yes. All right, let's fast forward. Olivia, give me five. We did it. We finished drawing and coloring our eagles and they turned out so perfect. Did you have fun? Yes. I especially love the eyelashes and your cute little pink cheek. What was the first letter that we drew? E. E, yeah, and then we turned it into an eagle because the word eagle starts with the letter E. E. You hope you have fun drawing eagle. We do. We hope you had a lot of fun and we hope you take time to color your drawings and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.